Hello there and salam Ibu Pertiwiku. The much-awaited 2020 budget will be tabled today at 4pm in the Dewan Rakyat by Finance Minister Lim Guan Eng. Many Malaysians have shared their expectations and desires for the budget 2020, including the desire to see the implementation of socio-economic initiatives that directly impact the ongoing digital transformations under the fourth Industrial Revolution IR 4.0. Majority of analysts say Budget 2020 will reflect the government's shared prosperity vision 2030, aims to restructure the economy and bridge disparities between the wealthy and the impoverished. The tabling of the Malaysia's Budget 2020 will be broadcast live via the mass media, social media channels and the Finance Ministry, MOF's official Facebook and Twitter accounts. Last Wednesday night, a total of 19 vagrants were taken off the town's central business district in a late-night operation. The operation was led by Welfare, Community Wellbeing, Women, Family and Childhood Development Minister Datuk Sri Fatima Abdullah, where she talked to the vagrants in an effort to save them from the street in Cebu. According to Fatima, since 2016, such operations have been carried out statewide with the aim of taking vagrants off the streets, giving them decent living, finding out issues affecting vagrants and to enable the authority to set up a database on vagrants in the state. From these operations, a total of 195 vagrants have been saved from the streets, with most of them aged between 50 and 59, followed by 40 to 49 age group. In conjunction with the state-level celebration of Head of State Tun Pahin Sri Abdul Taib Mahmud's 83rd birthday, the Sarawak's Pride Project Showcase Maze will be on display at the Miri City Fan Amphitheatre from today until October 13th. The display is a part of the ongoing showcase of the Sarawak's Pride Most Number of Unity Short Stories Project, which was launched on February 12th to collect the most number of unity short stories from Sarawak as an endeavor to showcase the intangible spirit of unity. This project showcased at Miri City Fan Amphitheatre will display 138 stories that have been submitted by members of the public mainly from the northern region along with selected stories from other divisions as well as the prize-winning stories. Members of the public are still welcome to share and submit their short stories on Unity by sending the stories through email sarawakpride at gmail.com and submit it to the SDI WhatsApp number at 013-671-8063. And that is all for now. I'm Shirabang Mansur. Keep updated to tvsarawak.com anytime, anywhere.